Now, let's do a trach change. Consider changing the trach tube with any trouble performing suctioning or oxygen desaturation that does not improve with suctioning. Trach changes are always a two-person procedure as one person will hold the trach tube in place while the second person manipulates the trach and inserts the new tube. Important supplies to have for a trach change include the same size trach and the obturator. The obturator is a rigid guide used to place the trach tube. The size smaller trach also needs to be available in case you are unable to insert the primary trach tube. If the child has a cuffed trach, an empty syringe is needed to deflate the cuff of the tube in place. A pre-filled syringe is needed to check the new trach tube cuff. Look for equal inflation around the trach tube and inspect for leaks. Be careful not to touch the tube, as it needs to remain sterile. Remember, Shiley cuffs are filled with air, while Bavona cuffs are filled with sterile water. After performing your cuff check, ensure you fully deflate the cuff. To determine the cuff volume, ask the child's caregiver. Water-based lubricant is used to make trach tube insertion easy. Other items to have at the bedside include the resuscitation bag and mask and the suction machine. Suctioning should be performed before and after the trach tube change to clear the airway. Now it is time to change the trach tube. Have one person keep the trach tube stable in the patient. Deflate the trach cuff as applicable. Remove one side of the old trach ties. Communicate with your partner timing of the trach tube change. Count to three. Insert the new trach tube and immediately remove the rigid obturator. The obturator, when in place, is occluding the airway. Continue holding the trach tube in place and inflate the cuff if needed. Attach the new trach ties. Ensure that the trach ties are tight. While still holding the trach tube in place, Sit the child up and lay them down. Readjust the trach tube's ties to ensure that no more than one finger can fit under the trach ties. Now, re-suction the child.